Gonna do some damage! Boomtown! August 21st, 2015. It is 3.05 p.m. And here are your top five players of Empires and Allies today. Uh, number one from Alliance CG. Don't know how to pronounce that one. Uh, Dennis Wynn, IBY, Shine Chow, and Tycor. All familiar faces that we've seen on the show before. And really excited to see them dominate their way back up to the top of the leaderboard. And uh, reclaim that throne, I should say. Uh, Tycor, we've seen him bounce all the way from number one all the way down to number 50 in the past. So it's great to see Tycor back on number five. But uh, in normal tradition, let's go ahead and take a look at the number five base. And see what exactly a number five on the leaderboard base looks like today. Here we go. Tycor's base uh, from Commander Union. Does look like he's changed uh, alliances. We see here some uh, different uh, some different strategy around their wall placement. So we can. It's definitely not a box around the HQ or maybe the honeycomb design that we've seen in the past or whatnot. This is definitely kind of walls scattered throughout, which is going to offer some type of strategic advantage being that Tycor is number five on the leaderboard. Um, we can definitely see some, some a lot of care going into this base and some very high level upgraded tarmacs and defensive units. So we salute you Tycor, 61,040 medals, solid base and keep up the good work. We hope to see you here soon at number one. All right, going back out to the leaderboard, let's go ahead and now take a look at number four. Number four is Shine Chow. Uh, Shine Chow, I'm not going to be able to pronounce that alliance name, but Shine Chow is holding down number four with 61,234 medals in Empires and Allies today. Solid work. And uh, let's go ahead and dive into Shine Chow's base here and see exactly what a number four on the leaderboard base looks like today. Boom! We've seen it before, and I'll comment again. Love the scattered wall design here. It does definitely look like uh, he's aiming at having some of those just scattered walls that seem to be upgraded. Let's see if I can zoom in here. Can't tell exactly what uh, what level, but I want to say that those are soaking up a lot of the splash damage around, you know, A10 strikes and orbital strikes and other uh, attacks that you know usually just kind of wipe out an entire area. I'm wondering how much those walls are actually absorbing of that. So. Solid, solid base here, Sign Chow. Looks like we're seeing some uh, comments on the in the chat as well, giving you some credit. So great job, and uh, we salute you. Sixty-one thousand two hundred and thirty-four medals in Empires and Allies. Congratulations. Let's move on. So working our way up the leaderboard today in top players. Next up, we got IBY from Commander Union. So have to say. Tycor, IBY, and Dennis Wen, all part of Commander Union, but were also recently a part of a different alliance. So maybe there's some trouble in Paradise over there, but we definitely see IBY stepping up to the number three spot with 62,181 medals. Let's go ahead and take a look at what IBY's base is looking like today. Boom! Good stuff here. Uh, we can definitely see that he has not chopped down those trees and is hiding some pretty powerful stuff behind it, I'm guessing. Even though that one metal rain there just sticks out like a sore thumb, I think he's, he's actually putting it there to scare people away, in my personal opinion. But um, IBY, solid. Oh, and love the bear flag. I want to say that was a prize from Leagues. So congratulations for hitting that. But uh, IBY... From Commander Union, we salute you. 62,181 medals. Way to go. Keep up the good work. And let's move our way up to number two. So the number two player of Empires and Allies today with a whopping 75,687 medals is Dennis Wen from Commander Union. Now, Dennis Wen, we've seen on the number one space in the past I believe even just last last week so we can see some duking it out up there at the top of the leaderboard between Dennis Yuen, IBY and the number one slot from the ZG Alliance but uh, here we go Dennis Wen, um great base design we can see a very high level wall placed just right around the side and just nothing but a mess of defensive units that I do not want to mess with 
adorning the inside. <laughs> Definitely is not something that I want to march my troops right into. Looks like he has a pretty solid defense structure going on um, right after you take out all those gimme buildings on the outside. So, Dennis Wynn, 75,687 medals. We salute you. Thank you for playing. And let's now move our way up to number one. The number one player in Empires and Allies today from Alliance ZG. Unfortunately, I don't speak this language, so I can't pronounce it. But here he is. The number one player, 76,003 medals. Currently, he's battling in Southern Latin America, and he has a record of 96-19 uh, wins and uh, 777 losses. So, uh, very good work here, and uh, we salute you and your alliance. Keep up the good work. And uh, let's now take a look at the top 50 players, shall we? So, well, of course, we are going to, you know, salute and take a look in the bases of each uh, of the top five players. But we do also want to kind of do a slow scroll here and give some credit to these players who are working their way up. We've seen a couple people already who have topped the leaderboard in the past who are, you know, going down to like 10 and 12 here. We see uh, Delta 6, definitely Mr. Apsky, uh, very famous name here on the show. Kara Cartel, 1979, Nicolo, uh, some cool names and alliance names down below here. But uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and go all the way down to number five. I actually, I think I'll even give a little soundtrack here. I think there is some music going. There we go. Robbie O, Robbie O S. I'm hoping that is not something I need to change. Alcanis, love that guy's YouTube videos from Nasty's Alliance. Awesome. And uh, oh, too cool. We've seen him major problem in the past. Jackal, and stop it at number fifty. Decky three three seven from Age of Silver Blades. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, commanders of all ages. These are your top 50 players of Empires and Allies today, August 21st, 2015, and it is 3.13. Let's remind ourselves that these uh, leaderboards are very volatile, and so I'm willing to bet. Now, when you get kind of toward up the top, clearly Dennis Wynn has a little bit to go before he catches up with the number one slot. But as we zoom down, you can see that the competition is really neck and neck, and sometimes you can actually see some... Uh, movement even while we're doing the segment uh, it has happened a couple times where the number three player moved his way up to number two or number one while I was doing the show so that's why I call out the, the date and time because we want to remember although these players are topping the leaderboards today you never know what's gonna happen tomorrow and the next day and the next day and the next day so solid work everybody and I think that's gonna do it for us with top players of Empires and Allies today <laughs>